To set up your image print color management settings, begin by going to Image and then Color Management. In the Color Management window, click on the Input tab. In the Embedded Profile Action drop-down menu, select Apply. When an image is opened in Image Print, this will apply the RGB profile that is currently assigned to the image. The Missing Profile Untagged Image section is needed for files that, for one reason or another, do not have an embedded ICC profile when they are opened in Image Print. Whatever you select in this section will be applied to images that are missing a profile. Click on the RGB drop-down menu and choose the color space that your images are normally tagged with. Although printing CMYK files isn't typical for Image Print users, select the appropriate color space from the CMYK drop-down menu if applicable. For gray, Select the gray space that your images are normally tagged with. For rendering intents, for RGB and gray, select either perceptual or relative colorimetric. Remember, the rendering intent will have different effects on different images. It is always recommended that you softproof an image to see which rendering intent might work best for a particular image. Next, click on the Output tab. This tab should be checked every time you print. For profiles, printer paper, you will always select the ICC profile for the media that you are printing to. Image Print also gives you the option of printing colorized black and white images. For these types of images, you would select the gray profile from the printer paper drop down menu and then the color profile in the colorized black and white drop-down menu. This will apply the gray profile to the black and white portion of the image and the color profile to the color portion of the image. The only other thing is to make sure that the press match profile under simulation setup is set to none. Accidentally selecting a profile here may yield less than satisfactory results for the typical user.